Jack Catterall wants to fight Teofimo Lopez. Let's talk about that right now. This is Power Grind Sports, where we're dedicated to the grind and dedicated to you. This is what's hot in the world of sports. We are jumping into the boxing world. Jack Catterall has his sights set on Teofimo Lopez, and he wants to fight Teo. Now, I was on social media, right? And I saw Regis Prograce call out Jack Catterall, but Jack Catterall, he wants to fight Teofimo Lopez over Regis Prograce, even though Regis Prograce called him out. Now, Jack Catterall, if you don't know, he was a reigning WBC champion and he sees a greater appeal and a better opportunity in a fight with Teofimo Lopez. Now, Jack Catterall is a British boxer who recently signed a multi-fight deal with Matchroom Boxing. And he believes that a fight with Teofimo Lopez would be a bigger draw over Regis Prograce. And you know, it's all about the money. You feel what I'm saying? And both fighters are looking to make a statement in a competitive super lightweight division you know because right now the lightweight division is on fire you got champion teofimo lopez you got a champion devin haney you got sabriel matias you got pitbull cruz man i'm telling you the lightweight division hey man it's um it's a little different and it's gonna be a little difficult hey Leave in the comment section, who do you think would win between Jack Catterall and Teofimo Lopez? Because Jack is preferring to fight Teofimo Lopez. Hey, what do you think about Regis Prograce calling Jack Catterall out, but then Jack Catterall avoiding that smoke? But he says, you know, there's greater appeal and better opportunity fighting Teofimo Lopez is that a duck? Let me know in the comment section. You know what I'm saying? Look, man, shouts out to Jack Catterall, though. You know, signing the match room. And hey, man, match room boxing, they are really doing great things for boxing right now. As for the super lightweight division, I don't know who's going to win what, but I do know that, man, it's going to be very difficult for anyone, whether it's a champion or non champion in that lightweight division. You got what I'm saying? Because boxing, when I think about it, it's not just about winning titles. It's about strategic matchmaking. You feel what I'm saying? And Jack Catterall's decision to target Teofimo Lopez over Regis Prograce shows you the importance of marketability, um, career management, and you know, popularity. You got what I'm saying? So you he, he's choosing a more appealing fight and Teofimo Lopez because he's trying to maximize his visibility and his opportunities in the sport. And I think that's smart. I think it's very ambitious. I think Jack Catterall is, you know, a mastermind with match room and they're doing strategic planning. You got what I'm saying? Because he got to enhance his boxing profile. You feel what I'm saying now in this competitive world of boxing, I'm telling you, I do believe that strategic decision making is very important. So when I'm looking at Jack Catterall do what he's doing and he's choosing to, to pursue a fight with Teofimo Lopez over Regis Prograce, hey, I'm thinking, hmm, who's more marketable, Teofimo Lopez or Regis Prograce? You know, hey, who's what's the more difficult fight? I think Jack Catterall and Regis Prograce is a more difficult fight than Jack Catterall and Teofimo Lopez. Hey, that's just what I think. You leave your thoughts in the comment section, but I'm telling you fighters focusing on selecting certain opponents for the best opportunity for their own visibility. Hmm, I think that's career management. I think that if athletes I want to achieve then they can achieve greater success if they are in the spotlight so you want to pick the bigger name and teofimo lopez has the bigger name because i'm telling you man success is not just about the titles that you win it's about making smart decisions strategic decisions 
because that's what's going to pave your way to success, especially when it applies to long term achievement, because these guys are prize fighters. So they're trying to get the most money. So longevity in this sport. Hey, that's the name of the game. You got me what I'm saying? But hey, like I said, leave your thoughts in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to Power Ground Boxing, reminding you to turn your dedication into domination. Stay on the grind. I'm going to talk to you later. Peace.